So y'all, in this particular video, I'm gonna give my dry, dusty, flat twist out. We're gonna, we gonna chalk it up to the game, okay? And we gonna just take this failed flat twist and turn it into a perm rod set okay that's what we that's what our natural hair people do when we don't when something didn't come out right we just you know we ain't gonna cry over we're not gonna cry we gonna dust yourself off and try again you can dust it off and try again try again and again gonna part my hair in four sections when I section my hair off I feel like it's a little bit easier to work with so let's section her okay so I'm gonna start with this piece here and I'm gonna section this off again. I think I'm gonna do like thicker pieces of hair. Last time when I did a perm rod set, I did thinner pieces of hair. So I'm gonna see how the results look when I make the curls a little bit thicker, okay? So we're gonna take this piece of hair and start the process. I'm gonna spritz her. To revitalize her a little bit cause she was dry and dusty, okay? Then I'm gonna take a little bit of leave-in conditioner. I'm gonna use this um, As I Am Classic Leave-In Conditioner. I'm gonna use her. Hopefully she is compatible with this twisting souffle and don't be looking real flaky. So we just gonna put her on there like that. My hair is like shedding. Like, no point no. Okay. Then we just gonna brush her through. She is lengthy, uh, uh, she got inches. Uh, don't play with me, hey. <laughs> okay, let me stop. Now I'm about to apply some of this twist and souffle. Ooh, I really hope this comes out cool cause she disappointed with that flat twist. She disappointed. I just feel like when I apply it, like it don't look shiny. Y'all know how some products, when you apply it on your hair, it just really moisturizes that piece. Like, I don't know. This twist and souffle, I don't think it's it. But I'm gonna give her another chance and see. We just gonna go with it. Okay, so I'm gonna just twist my root a little bit just to make sure they kind of you know they don't because my roots be getting frizzy so we gonna twist her a little bit like that and then brush her through like that and then take our perm rod girl this souffle makes me nervous because let me put some more on my ends Maybe this ain't good for a perm rod. I don't know. You're about to see though. Okay. 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 She locked in there. Moving on, okay? I'm just getting this second piece of hair. Don't want them to be too small and not too big either, cause then you ain't gonna get the results that you're looking for. Fray her, buy a little leave-in. And you guys, usually I apply leave-in um, when I'm in the shower, but that's usually when I'm washing my hair. Obviously, I'm not washing my hair. This is an old style. So I'm trying to revitalize her and give her some life. So I'm applying leave-in on each piece of hair along with some water, okay? Cause she needs, we gotta bring her back to life, girl.
y'all, perm rod set is all finished. I'ma let my hair air dry for two days, and that's just that. Let's get into this look. Well, let's let's get into these these, these perm rods by the end. Is what I mean. Okay, y'all, I got my coconut oil because you know you gotta have some kind of oil when you are um, undoing a hairstyle just to try to reduce that frizz, add a little extra shine. Get into it, all right? Okay, so let's start with, I always like to start with the back. Okay. Okay, cute. She's curled, okay? So far, so good, y'all. I ain't mad at it so far. And when I think about it, I actually put the olive oil on too soon. I should have done it after I unraveled all of the curls. I wasn't thinking, but I'm not gonna take it off because we ain't wasting no coconut oil. We ain't wasting no product. She real bouncy. Okay, now um, since I'm taking her apart, now I have use for the olive oil on my hands. So let's get into this. Let's let it go like that. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Right now I'm just pulling the hair apart. Y'all already know how this go. Okay, so now I'm gonna just kind of pin it up just a little bit because I can tell my hair is gonna like kind of be in my face and I don't really want that today. So we're gonna pin her up a little bit, okay? I'm about to try to attempt to try to do a baby hair. Child, I'm, mm, we about to see how this go cause I don't usually do this, but we gonna see. I'm not gonna do too much. I'm gonna just do a little bit cause this is a lane I should not be going down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it my way, okay? Okay, and I'm gonna take this girl and I'm gonna just shout. Uh uh, honey. Bro. Bro, okay, she got one little swoop in there. I don't know if it looks like how it's supposed to be looking, but I don't know why. I just can't. Okay, here's. I got a little something going on. Okay, she got a little curve. This is something I'm gonna need to practice a little bit more. Mm -mm. Let me see this side now. Oh, girl. I cannot believe I'm attempting to do this. 
See, uh-uh, uh-uh, let me stop before I mess up my hair. If you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, let me know what you thought about me and my attempt to do my baby hairs and all that jazz. Thank you so much for watching and until my next video, peace.